Hey everybody and welcome to the Bullsheep Party and in this video we're gonna cover the update Rockstar just released for GTA Online for the week of June 4th 2020. So let's get started. First let's go over the discounts and the first thing that we have on discount is the MOC or the Mobile Operation Center. Now if you were lucky enough to win the half truck a couple of weeks ago you needed the Mobile Operation Center in order to customize it. So if you haven't sold it and if you still have it this is a good purchase for you and it's discounted down to $735,000. And next up, we have the Rogue, and it's discounted down to $720,000 if you trade it in, and if you wanna buy it upright, it's $960,000. And right below it, we have the Adriant, and that one's discounted down to $690,000. And from Legendary Motorsport, you can get the Ocelot Swinger right now for only $550,000. But if you're looking for something really, really cool, you can grab right now the Vapid Caracara 4x4 for only $525,000. And if you've never experienced this vehicle, I highly recommend you shell out half a million and buy it up front. It's so good, it's gonna be the best vehicle you have in your garage. Continuing on with the discounts, arcades are down 50% this week. But if you wanna upgrade your existing arcade, don't bother because the upgrades are their usual price. The same goes for facilities. Facilities are 50% discounted, but that doesn't extend to the facility upgrades. So if you want to purchase a new facility, good, go ahead. If you want to upgrade your existing one, don't bother. And if you're looking to make some double cash in RP this week, you can go ahead and do the Rocket Voltic stunt races and the Ruiner 2000 stunt races. And as every week, Rockstar has released new time trials that are gonna give you $100,000 when you complete them, so make sure you stay tuned to this channel because I will be making videos about them and how to beat them successfully. And all that brings us to the main event, the Ubermacht CS1. And if you ask me, it's one of the better looking cars in the game. And I think it looks like an old BMW M1. But what do you think? Leave a comment down below telling me what real world car do you think this one resembles. I don't know about performance because I never owned one, but this is a perfect time for me to do so. And if you are looking to get this particular one for free, make sure you follow this guide where I show you exactly how to do it. I literally won the car about 15 minutes ago. And that'll do it for this week's GTA Online Weekly Update. Thank you so much to everybody who watched. If you found this video helpful or useful, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.